Hi, this is Jeff. Hey, I recently took uh, Andy and Chelsea over at the Toys R Us to pick out a toy because they were helping me with my side businesses. And the one is the uh, washerbearings.com, which is the uh, washing machine bearings and seal kits. And the second one was actionsforsuccess.com, which is a uh, simple blogging system that lets you, you just make blog posts by pushing buttons and uh, they're even adding a feature where you can upload video right from your phone, your iPhone or your Android. So that way you can do blog posts without even processing the video and then uploading it. So it makes it one step, basically, for your videos. So I hope you enjoy this. This one, uh, Andy picked out the Air Hogs. It's a uh, RC submarine and actually uh, works in water. It's pretty cool. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks. Okay, here's the Air Hog submarine. If I get on it, there it is. It will uh, dive and surface, and it will go forward, backwards, left, right. It's a pretty neat little device. There it's sitting on top of the water. And we can go ahead and uh, tell it to dive. We've got a mission to go on. We're going to dive. There, it's going under. It does have a red LED. Let you know it's on. It's small, it's about three inches long maybe. It's not real big. It's a pretty cool piece of technology there. All right, and I'll do a, show it close up too. It's got a little propeller on the back, plus it's got two thruster. It has a thruster, it'll actually send it out the left or right. That's how it steers. It's pretty cool for being so small. It's right there, it's submerged. Go ahead and uh, surface again. Break it some air. Now it's surface. Pretty cool. All right, let's take a look at this little uh, this little submarine. It's got a little propeller on the back. And that's pretty uh, pretty small. It looks like this area here is to receive the uh, infrared signal from the controller. And just got this little section on the bottom here. Um, now to turn it on, you just close this hatch and it actually will short out, it looks like there's a, a jumper so it actually shorts out two of these pins and, and that activates it. And notice how it's blinking? As soon as I turn on the transmitter, it will go solid, okay? That means it's getting a signal if it's solid. And you can actually, uh, you see the propeller work. There's forward, reverse, left. Right. Now left right I believe is from here. I think it's the little pump. It actually pumps water out this side or pumps water out this side to make the back end swing around. I think that's how the steering works. Uh, dive. You have a uh, button up here. And open the surface. It's turning that motor inside it. It must be opening up a valve or something to let air in or let water in. Okay. Now, when um, if this battery gets low, it says it will actually surface if it's underwater. So you turn it off, you open the hatch up, and let's say we want to prove <laughs> charge it back up. You just uh, take this plug. And you plug it in like that, I notice the display went to charge mode. Now one thing it does when it does, uh, it takes eh, I think about 20 minutes to charge up, depending on how low the battery is, but when it's done, it'll just shut off, which is good. I was hoping it wouldn't go to the green light because then it would be discharging the battery. So it does shut off after the, uh, the submarine is charged. So that's pretty cool, I like it. So uh, yeah, overall I think it's a pretty cool little uh, submarine. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, review of the Air Hogs Submarine. And if you have any uh, questions, go ahead and uh, leave a comment below. Thank you. This is uh, Jeff Hartman. Bye-bye.